12 years, 145 monthly columns, 868 tricks. For the first time, it's all in one place, ready for you to discover. For 12 years, I was the tricks editor at Magic Magazine, where I wrote a column called Talk About Tricks. Every month, I would describe the latest and greatest effects from some of the world's best magicians. David Williamson, Lance Burton, Paul Harris, Jay Sankey, Pitt Hartling, Darwood Ortiz, Jeff McBride, and on and on and on. I also published some of the last tricks from legends who have since passed on. Martin Gardner, Brother John Hammond, Larry Jennings. And I even published some of the first Magic in print from magicians who have gone on to do remarkable things. Danny Garcia, Kaylin Morelli, Harapan Ong, Paul Vihil, Asi Wind. Now, all of this magic is finally available in one gorgeous set of books. It's two volumes made of the finest material. They have a translucent dust jacket and they both pack into a slipcase. Every month for 12 years, I describe between four and eight close-up effects using every kind of magic you can describe. Lots and lots of cards and coins, but also magic with everything from pens to pets to Christmas trees. Anything you can imagine in your home, there's certainly a great trick from my column using that object. It's not really my style to sit here and brag about any particular tricks in the Talk About Tricks columns. You'll find your own favorites and you'll go through them. But I do think it's fair to say that when this column was running, this was the place that people wanted their material to appear. You'll find the very best magicians tipping their very best tricks month after month. These books are overwhelming in size and they will keep you busy for a very, very long time. And I mean that in a good way. The format of my column was sort of trailblazing in its own way, too. I realized that it frustrated readers when they would read halfway through a trick only to discover that it exceeded their skill level. So we instituted a visual guide at the top of each trick to show you, at a glance, how easy or hard it would be. And the column is called Talk About Tricks, and that's what I did. I interviewed each creator about their trick. Why did they want to make this trick a parlor piece? Why did they add on this second and this phase instead of there? Is there anything they still aren't satisfied with? With Talk About Tricks, the complete file, you'll learn lots of tricks. But because of this format, you'll also learn a great deal about how tricks are created and the creative process for many of your favorite magicians. One of the most popular aspects of my column was the last page, which we called Expert Talk. I recognize that not everyone is interested in a brand new trick idea. Some of the very best insights are extremely small tweaks to existing moves or tricks. Sometimes it's just a little tip that unlocks a move's potential or makes it 20 times more deceptive. Expert Talk was about getting this exclusive advice from experts. David Williamson talks about the top change, Gary Plants on the bottom deal, Ken Krenzel on the mechanical reverse. Even if you skip just to this page every month, it's like getting every major move in magic taught by the expert on that move. You have to understand, writing this column for 12 years took a substantial part of my life. And I used to feel like those pages, those tricks, that time was largely forgotten. I'm so pleased that with the cooperation of Magic Magazine, we're now able to bring this collection to you in an absolutely stunning two-volume set of hardcover books that you'll study for years to come.